welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I will be showing you how we prepared for our first vacation and show you as well what the northern part of Cebu looks like now. So if you guys are interested, stick around because I'm here to pass it on. Since March this year, my family and I have totally been indoors except for my husband who is a frontliner, but my daughter and I We've never been outside the fence for the last five months. This week, our provincial government announced that Cebu tourism is finally reopened. Some Cebu tourist attractions are already operational, but with many precautionary anti-COVID-19 measures. Please take note that we are from the Cebu province, not from Cebu City, which is still on GCQ. Before the pandemic, our family traveled a lot. We've already made travel plans for this year, but COVID-19 happened. All our travel plans, both domestic and international, were canceled. This is fine because, of course, safety is our first priority. But now, we've started to open up the country to tourists and domestic travel. However, please let us not forget that the virus is still around us and that we have to adapt to the new normal. All our new normal and travel gear will be featured in another video, so make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so that you will be notified when the videos are up. So going back to our first vacation, my family was so eager to spend time outside the house. Since traveling by plane is not an option for us, we decided that all our trips would have to be road trips using our old car. To better prepare for our new normal vacations, we drove to the northern part of Cebu and see what it was like after months of quarantine. We did not stop at any public places like beach resorts or restaurants even if they were already open. Good thing because we noticed these places were already full of people. We believe that even if we are already allowed to move around, that we should still practice social distancing and avoid unnecessary contact with other people. Oh, new normal, si Ate na maligya nag face mask, de ba? Good job. Hey guys, so we are looking for a parking spot so that we can have a lot Here, as you can see, we stayed 15 to 20 meters away from other people who also stopped along the road to eat and rest. lunch, enjoyed the fresh sea breeze, and appreciated the beauty of nature. After eating, we placed all the stuff we brought in the trunk and used our UVC light to disinfect it. 
Using UVC lights to disinfect all the stuff we brought outside the house is also ideal for this situation because you can disinfect a lot of items at one time and you can do that while you are doing something else. While waiting for the disinfection to complete, we took a lot of videos and photos. After that, we went straight back home. Even if it was just for a few hours, the trip was refreshing because of the fresh air and warm sun. God has blessed our trip with clear skies since it has been raining hard these past few days. We thank God for the good weather. We are still adapting to the new normal life, so in the future, I will be sharing with you what we've learned as we go. For now, the only challenge was toilet breaks. We don't want to go inside public restrooms, so we need to solve this problem for future trips. I will be sharing with you the solution in another video, so stay tuned, make sure to subscribe, and hit the notification bell, alright? Hey guys, so we are finally home! <sighs> Somebody is sleepy because of the road trip. Hi, Renee. Hi. So, we definitely need to disinfect everything. Everything good, even our clothes, even this camera. Remember, disinfect to protect. Bye. Say bye-bye. Bye. Say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye. When we arrived at home, we went straight to the shower. Our clothes soaked with soap and water. We also disinfected everything using our UVC lights. So I made a separate video about UVC lights, air purifiers, home disinfection. I'll just place the cards right here. I'll also place the links at the description box. Also, if you have any questions, please feel free to drop a comment down below. We need to adapt to the new normal life and help our healthcare workers fight this pandemic. We need to do our part. And remember, even if we are allowed to move freely, we still need to practice social distancing and wear a mask every time we are out. As much as possible, do not go to public places or places where crowds gather like churches, gyms, recreational facilities, salons, and restaurants. So there you go guys, I hope this video helps. I hope this video gave you an idea on what to do or what to expect on your first vacation after the ECQ. Make sure to disinfect to protect. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Again, hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I have new videos. Stay healthy, stay safe. God bless everyone. Bye!